welcome back to Minecraft Monday. Might as well be called Minecraft Tuesday episode. It's Minecraft nine. Wednesday! Oh, yeah, it will be Wednesday now. Ugh. So I apologize for the delay. Um, I'm back at school, and my first two days have been hectic, so I apologize. Um, and I'm actually really, really tired, so I'm going to be barely doing any talking this episode. And, heck, I haven't actually done a lot on the server. Anyways, so we're going to let health... Kind of just guide us through. I will be participating, and yes, I will still talk. I'm just saying I'm going to kind of let him lead the way this time. So, <laughs> I'm the leader now. Just for come on, bitch. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> All right. So first things first. Let's start off with outs. Work our outside in. Um, I have captured, to say the least, uh, quite a few animals, and well. I started off with two pigs, two sheep, and unfortunately only one bovine. But I've been, uh, I've, uh, what do you call it? Breeding them. And actually, I'll go get some, uh, see blue really quickly while I go get some wheat. Yeah, I'll show, them all. I'll show it off to him. Um, so, many, as here. many people know, I got it. As, okay. as many people, as people will know a few episodes back, uh, we ended up getting a carrot and I had a fishing rod. So we're going to show off the... If I get on the pig with a saddle... Oh, no. Yep. See, I can't do Which, anything, right? Which kind of sucks. Yeah. Well, actually, I, how it was set up originally was that if you just had the saddle, um, it was like the pig would just wander wherever. So the well, system was... It still is now. It like, still is. I was showing that off, how he just kind of wanders around. Mm -hmm. If I pull out the fishing rod, I can direct him by aiming the rod in the direction I want to go. It's not perfect, and it's still slow. And he does eat the carrot slowly, I noticed. Mm-hmm. So. Um, but it's like he starts out slow, but he actually gets exponentially faster after a while. He has a limit, though. It's not like, uh, what is, what's that truck game? Oh. That racing... <laughs> Yeah. It's like exponential, exponentially faster while, uh, dude, that's funny as shit seeing you ride around. Your, your arms are going back and forth like you're walking. Oh, really? <laughs> you don't see me on a pig, do you? Well, I just, I just did the third person camera. Let's see if I can do one more. There we go. Whoa, it's kind of, what the fudge. It kind of even worked. All right, we'll get off. All right, I'll get off this thing. Just... Look down and right click. Oh, okay. So yeah, that's the kind of cool thing to just show off that feature. It's kind of cool to be able to control the piggies now. Yep. And now, since we actually ran into like a problem of, see, once I pull out a carrot there, they're like, hmm, I want so. Nice. But anyway, um, we were running into a problem of not enough food. So since I got them, since I got a whole bunch of uh, animals here, we can start uh, breeding them. And we shall slaughter them all. No? Okay. No. But look at the cute little piggy. Yep. Aww, big I head love it how he has the same size head as the others. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. He, or similar size. Um, and now, I will do the same with sheep. See, the sheep and the cows go for wheat, while the pigs like grass, or like uh, carrots. So let's shoot. There we go. Let's choose these two here. So they'll make some uh, lamb love, or some sheep love. We got a lamb. Look at the tiny sheep, he's cute. Right, move out of my way. Go ahead. You first, me next, there we go. Unfortunately, he, has, he does not have a companion. Not yet, we will in the future. No, well, the last cow that I saw that was free, that I could capture him or her, whatever, was so far away it was ridiculous. Hmm. But we'll actually get to that in a little bit. So next, let's go back into our house and we'll be heading up. Um, actually, we'll be heading downstairs real quick. Okay. Um. Really, just really quick. Uh, last episode. I'm pretty sure last episode, when we were in this server, we said that we were going to go into the nether. Unfortunately, in this episode, we won't be. Mm -hmm. We'll save that for next episode when we are um, More less tired. 
Yeah, less yeah, tired and more prepared. So. Yeah. So oh, I so then I do want to show something real quick. Um, so, uh, oh, oh I'll, uh, never mind. I'll explain it later. Never mind. Shh. Okay. So I've just been updating uh, the downstairs base a little bit. Um, see, I, whenever I have an infinite pool like this, I just like to uh, put um, whatever lapis lazuli or whatever this is called in block form around it. I think it looks nice. At a sheer glance, I could just see all oh, blue water. <laughs> so um, I've expanded a little bit. Um, and also, blue. Mm -hmm. I shall show them my secret. Oh. False wall, bitches. Nice. And down thing. here. And actually, Blue, remember that cavern that we're that uh, that crevice that we wanted to show them? Mm -hmm. This runs right into the same crevice. Oh, nice. nice. Didn't realize it. Um, but hold on, I need to take care of these guys. Okay. What is See, this? See, I'm planning on making a gigantic arboretum. Cool. And under, and I was actually planning to have this completed by now, but I ran into some problems. But hey, you see that? That lone torch on that little cliff right there. Yeah. That's where we were. Offline. Oh. We ended up. That's oh, where that's we. Oh, that's so cool. Oh. Yeah. So. No. This is where we wanted to take you the other time. Yeah. So oh. I've I've um. What was it? I ended up falling down, <laughs> and uh, hitting the ground pretty hard, but I survived. So I so I did a little bit of exploring outwards, um, but there are. There are um, paths, branching paths, from here in. So I haven't explored those yet. Nice. But this is... Originally, I was thinking of making a, the Arboretum go the the length of the, care, uh, the length of the crevice, but I thought that it actually might be better if I just started going straight back. Hmm. So then I would have solid footing. Yeah. Looks nice. Right. So far, at least. Hey, there's a coal so, mine up there. That bothers me. I know. Um, coal vein, I should say. Sorry. Yeah. No, it was like uh, whenever I was mining, um, I would have actually had to literally almost kill myself just to get that. And I was like, eh, no, I'm not prepared to do that. <laughs> but anyway, I shall seal it back up just in case. Because I've had, I've had creepers show up down in there. Oh. Uh. So okay. we don't want... Oh, um, we only showed our viewers Sheila, I believe. Mm -hmm. But we have Sheila, Steve, and where the hell's Malachi? He's down... What the fuck is he? <laughs> he might actually be doing his job. <laughs> yeah, the other ones... Seriously, seriously, this is like a union. Back here is their, is their uh, rest area. This is their break room. Back here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see if Malachi is actually doing his job down here. Yeah, he is. Malachi is actually on duty. He looks so sad. <laughs> That's how he kills people. What's he trying to kill? I don't know. There's maybe there's a monster close by and he sees him, or he like his programming notices yeah. him. But um, no, he's sitting there. In the corner, it's like, what is this? What is my life? <laughs> All right, but, uh, sir. I need, I need to get food real quickly. Oh yeah. Go ahead. Hey, um, real quick. I have a whole production here. Would Where? you like? Where? Right here. Where are, you? Where are you? Come over here. Hello. Hello, Blue. There you are. Okay, I haven't seen you yet. You disappeared off my screen. Here, I'll just make you bread. Okay. Wait patiently for Chef uh, Health. This is Iron Health, like literally. I... <laughs> no, Iron... Bad joke. Iron... <laughs> Dude, it's so bad that <laughs> it's just like, what the hell? <laughs> well, made... You're made of iron, and you've heard of Iron Chef, so Iron yes. Health. So I know it's awesome. Are we done down here? Yes, we are done down here. 
Alright, I'm just gonna throw my slime balls into the little lava here. There's no point in keeping them. <laughs> we have too many to begin with. But anyway, let's continue our tour up through our... up to our observatory. Ah! Uh, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. He's breaking it down! Should I let him in? Or should I let him break it down? Oh. <laughs> I went for the door! <laughs> you went for the door rather than us! <laughs> that is so friggin... Hello! <laughs> I can't... I can't get in the fucking door. There we go. You're letting them in! Close the door. You got it. That was hilarious. He's just like, well, fuck you guys. Alright, so we're gonna go up here next. I know okay. we've showed this, but uh Yeah, we showed it from a distance. Um, but we have not I don't think we've shown it off. Yeah, well we they've seen the start of it. Yep. Um, okay, in this direction I went really far and I have mine I have mine carts that we're gonna go out there in a little bit. And I also extended this outwards quite a bit. Nice, nice. Uh, though that section's not absolutely complete yet, nor is the other one, but the other one actually goes somewhere, at least. Um, and we have not gone up here and shown our enchanting room. Real quick, I'm going to show the map just to see how far it extends. That's quite extensive. Mm -hmm. Come on up. Uh, here's the cool room. This actually is not complete yet, but here, uh, you have an enchanted sword, but I do not. So I'm going to throw you my sword, and no, if I you... have, I have my enchanted sword. No, I want you to enchant my sword so you can oh, so they okay. see the enchanting. I gotta waste my levels on you. Okay. Anyway, so for those who don't know, uh, in the most re one of the more recent, I think it's the most recent, but I th I'm going to say more recent because they could have more it. recent. It's not most recent. Okay, they added enchanting tables. So enchanting tables that you enchant the items. Which, if you notice, I've been gaining levels as I do things. Um, like it says, level fifteen. That's really I wouldn't even call that a level system. It's more like how many bars of magic do you have? Um, Wait, really quickly, really quickly. How many levels do you have? Fifteen. <laughs> okay. Know. Here. Okay. Whenever I w before I died. You were fifty. I know. Yeah, I know. I was at <laughs> level 50, then I died and lost it all. So, but I'm level 15, so that's how many bars I can use up. I'm actually almost level 16, but... Um, so, what you do is you drag the sword up here into this little box here. And now, see, there's these random enchantments that you can get. Um, there is a way to read this text. I don't know it. I don't plan on learning it. It's not going to happen. No, it's a pain um, in the ass, and they're actually riddles anyway. That's even worse. That's... Ugh. So anyway, so this kind of just rolls the dice. Obviously, the stronger or the better the or the more bars you use, the better the enchantment. That's usually the rule, yeah. yeah it's, I mean, it's just a typical rule of thumb. So I'm going to crank in seven here for him, and we're going to see what we get. And the sword is iron sword, and it only gained one enchantment, which is sharpness level one. That's not bad. No. Uh, my sword, the one I have, has fire aspect one and smite two. Bastard. Which, it was a really good sword in my opinion. Yeah, uh, throw me my throw me my shitty sword. Thank you. So and if you see now it's got this hue. Now you can get even better enchantments. The idea is that this book and it's something I plan on doing in the future is because since you have a nice wheat uh production. Um, the, the way you increase the enchanting table is by filling the room full of books. See, with the enchanting, as you can see, it slowly sucks out the magic from this bookcase. So it actually gives a purpose to bookcases now. It's not just like there's bookcases. Mm -hmm. um, let's see here. The bookcases can go too deep mm -hmm. and I forget how many out wide. But that's also why we need cows. So Because we need leather for the books. Right. So... So that gives us purpose to do that. Um, let's see here. Also, you know, remember we got enchanted books? Mm -hmm. Well, what um, the purpose of enchanted books now is like, apparently they, uh, the team working on this, uh, I think it was, I mean, after Notch stopped working on it, stopped mm -hmm. working on this, they figured out that the whole enchanting system, we're not leaving. Oh, we're not? Back. What nope. the heck is that left of here? Anyways, keep talking. Here you go. This will give you a hint. Oh, okay. Um, 
uh, what is it? Okay, so they realized that it's kind of a dumb idea to kind of put in that reading system that nobody can read, and if you decipher it, it gives you a riddle anyway. Mm-hmm. So they pretty much. So now that you're able to enchant books, you are basically you can just throw in a book and just depending on. I mean, if you have your entire inventory full of books, that's I guess that's better. But just keep throwing in books and just keep enchanting them because later on, I believe it's an anvil. There's some sort of... Okay, some yeah, sort I, know, I know there's the anvil. Yeah, yeah, but there's some sort of thing that you can craft that you can take the books and just enchant your items directly from the books. Cool. So that will be uh, more efficient than just uh, throwing it in. No, and just oops, it. crap. Didn't mean to do that, but all right, we'll take this. Oh, shit! Again. What? Hold on. I missed I missed my ride. Oh. <laughs> we'll see if the world can load fast enough for my case. Dude, do you remember? I actually hit my headset. Do you remember back in the day? I know I get to say this. This kind of makes me feel old. Uh, do you remember when you couldn't use minecarts or boats because it would like screw up the server too bad? Were yes. you around back then? Yeah. Look at this, the world's just kind of forming around us. You can see all the lava veins, look at that. Well, it's forming around you, it's already formed around me. <laughs> but anyway, um, we're actually going to, uh, my, I don't know how far ahead you are than me, because I actually had to catch my ride and then keep pushing it for a little bit. Um, but this, how do I get have out? you gotten to the end of my track yet? Yep. Okay. I'm here now. Hey, it's your minecart. I didn't bring a thing. Oh, there. Can you bring no, you can mine? just punch it. Oh, you can. Come yeah. on, it's not. It's not continuing to punch. Thank you. Stupid. I have both. Okay. Here. Anything out okay. here? Uh, just there you go. Well, I was planning on continually. Once I get enough iron and wood, I stop this production because I ran out. But you'll see that I have continued the track in certain places and we're gonna follow this track real quick just to show off how far I've gone out but uh, I I ended up drilling straight through this hillside and there was iron and coal here so that's why there's a hole um, if that annoys you you can fill it <laughs> <laughs> but this goes out here and to where I died, <laughs> died for like what? the first time, um, I got raped by many monsters. Huh. Because out here in the desert, I ran into four Endermen um, just in one little patch. There was four Endermen, 12 zombies, six skeletons, and five creepers that all decided that they hated me. Sounds like fun. So, yeah. So I died out here. Couldn't find where, where my stuff landed. But anyway, this is the end of my track so far. Um, but this whole desert here, um, there's actually two tiers to it. And it heads off to the, if if this is, if our track continues to north. I don't know if that actually is north, but whatever. I'm going to use this as north. Um, this continues off to um, the northeast into two tiers and then we also have this little um this little oasis over here mm -hmm. and i explored a little bit i didn't go the whole perimeter mm -hmm. but this is i'm pretty sure this is just one little circle in this desert hmm. so it really is an oasis nice. so that is that's pretty much it cool so um, so this episode, we just kind of wanted to bring you the limelight of what's been going on at the server, update you what's going on, nothing to explore, nothing to do. We will be doing the nether soon, but there is an update I do want to bring up. Um, some have showed expressed interest in me creating, I forget the name of the app, but basically to let me show the map online uh, while the server's up and running. Um, oh, nice. Yeah, so people are interested in that. So my objective is to show like an overhead map so you guys can see our world as it's expanding and you can kind of get like a heads-up heads view of what's going on. Um, so mm -hmm. I do plan on looking into that this week. 
most likely okay. won't be done this week. Um, I'm not going to give a deadline on when it will be done. But it is a future project. So, uh, yeah. If somebody can also, give me a good name of an app that works really – or not an app, uh, a mod that works really nicely, to give, uh, give me a heads up. Um, I'll throw it up there. I know there's a few out there, but um, I was going to get the one that I used with my old server. Let's uh, see if that works still. Okay. So. Um, there's actually uh, one other thing that I added, mm -hmm. um, but that is out towards the uh, the jungle temple. Oh, crap. I missed my ride again. Um, I decided since that goes out to a winter biome, we should make that as an outpost. Okay. So I've done a little bit of outpost making there. So pretty much I guess we're just going to show that off, and then we can, we can end the episode there. Because that is literally all I got. Unless you got any ideas. Nope. That's, that's plenty. And that's what my idea was, was just to kind of go through, show what's been going on, show you kind of the cool ideas that's been forming. I haven't been able to do any of my stuff because, let's be straightforward, I've just been busy, man. Um, so. Mm -hmm. I also blame the 3DS. It's eating up a lot of my time. Uh, it's... A lot of my free time, I should say. There you go. You're gonna have that one. Okay. There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, shit. No, no. Stop it. No! Actually, no, what? No. What? No. What happened? Hot break. God dang it. Got it. I'm down already. Yeah, I already. Whee! I already. Oh, so, you... wait, do... so wait, do we have to trek all the way out there? Yeah. No, nah, we're not going to cover that this episode then. It takes a good okay, almost five minutes fine. to get there. So, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to it. Next time on uh, Minecraft Monday, we're going to continue the Banjo Kazooie level Clanker's Cavern. So, if you're enjoying that, uh, can't wait to do continue and that. And damn, if, if Treasure Trove Cove took us an hour, that's going to be an hour. <laughs> yeah, sadly. Well, no, it only took us, I thought it only took like 35 minutes to do. I don't know, dude. Because apparently, I'm God at calling time, because, uh, when I said 20 minutes, guess what time it was in the video when I said I think it's 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Yes, it was. <laughs> so. Man, I wish I had that kind of prowess whenever doing my Let's Plays. <laughs> I've been doing oh, it for wait. way too long. <laughs> Wet Let's Plays. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. It's got to do stuff. We'll see you guys next time on Minecraft Monday. Expect some Spyro this week because uh, that's kind of the game I've been playing right now. So see you guys later. Bye-bye. See you guys. Have a nice day.